Hello everyone, welcome to SciT. I am Roshan Akhtar, 4th year medical student, University of Colombo. In this video, I am going to share with you my experience of doing my first ever psychiatric appointment in National Institute of Mental Health, Sri Lanka. We Colombo medical students study the psychiatry theory in a module called Mental Health Module and we already have finished that module and we were expecting to do an appointment, I mean the psychiatry appointment, so that we can apply what we have learned in a clinical setting. In this video particularly, I will be sharing about everything that happened on the first day of my psychiatry appointment. Without wasting time, let's jump into the vlog. On the first day, I waked up at 5.15. This is a little earlier than my usual waking time. I love to wake up early because I believe that when I wake up early, I have more time to do more things. After coming from the washroom, I made myself some tea. These days, I really, really miss the milk powders. I had to stick to the Sri Lankan milk powders that are available, which are moderately tasty. While having my tea, I was scrolling through the lecture note on pharmacology psychiatry. This particular lecture note is very difficult for me because there is a lot to remember. So I decided to study the psychiatry pharmacology that morning so that I will be able to understand the management of psychiatric illnesses clearly. As it was the first day of our appointment, we had to search and find our ward. My group was supposed to go to the ward number 8, which is a male ward. We reached the place by 8.30. In the ward, we were supposed to take histories from the patients by talking to them. Initially, we were scared of the patients because uh, we thought that the psychiatric patients would be aggressive towards us and they may harm us. So we didn't enter the patient's space. We talked to the patients through the windows. And after some time, one of the nurses came and asked us to go inside the patient's space telling that they are not aggressive as we think. So that we decided to go inside and the patients uh, unexpectedly were very respectful to us and they, most of them immediately started to build a rapport with us and they were very cooperative and they gave the histories. Sometimes due to the medical conditions, patients are unable to 
tell the information about them so that at those instances we had to go through the BHTs and collect the information so that we could understand the medical condition of the patient properly. After taking histories, we discussed the histories among ourselves and we also had a class, a word class by our registrar about how to take a proper history from a psychiatric patient. Because psychiatric history taking is completely different from taking a history from a normal patient so that that class meant a lot to us and it was very useful for us. As usual our clinical works finished at 12 o'clock and after that we came back to our faculty. Before going to the hostel, I stayed at the faculty for some time. When I was spending my time at the faculty, I downloaded some episodes of Good Doctor, which is a very interesting medical series.